What is going on YouTube? I'm back with another YWB banger. It feels good to say that shit. I've had, okay, I've had a, a, a decent break. It's been about two weeks now. I just uploaded two videos, you know, in the last two days. I have a lot of shit going on in personal life. You know, um, I'm not gonna lie. A lot of like, just, it's more mental health, really, bro. Just like, like I've been working my dick off. I work at FedEx. I do like package handling. I've been doing YouTube. I've been trying to like get a battery for my cart because I have a couple carts. I just don't have the superb battery because they're superb. I'm not trying to. Okay, I already exposed it. But um, I got some superbs on the way. It's just I need the battery for them. Nobody has batteries. So I've been not able to do like a, a review video. And um, I've been really I, I haven't had Wi-Fi for like two weeks as well. A little over two weeks. So that's another cause. But hey, let's let's do this chemical class. Let's get right into the video. So today's chemical class, we're talking about cl cl clonazepam. God damn, I can't speak. Clonazepam, aka clonopin, K-pins, Rivitol, whatever you want to call it. So I've talked about Xanax slash Oprazolam slash Bromazolam yesterday's video. Uh, I just little uploaded it yesterday on the 12th of January. And also, Happy New Year's, boys. I kind of missed out on that, too. Damn, it's been so long. It's been since uh, December. So, hey, I'm going to try to get every day consistent uploads. But, hey, let's go right into the video. I already mentioned K-Pens. So, I, as I mentioned, I talked about Alprazolam a little bit on the video. I was more of a user of Alprazolam. K-Pens are something you, you rarely get, okay? K-Pens are like... The 2CB of the benzo world, okay? So, like, you rarely get Klonopin, bro. Like, it's mostly just Xanax. Everybody has Farmer Pram. Everybody has, like, somebody that can easily press, like, 500 Bromas pills. With benzos and, like, opiates nowadays, you really only get, like, designer shit or, like, you get the most popular ones. Like, you only really see Xanax or, like I mentioned, Bromas. You don't get K-Pens. And... Klonopin is no different than than Xanax slash Alprazolam. So roughly two milligrams of of K pens are equivalent to two milligrams of Alprazolam. It's literally the same shit. Okay, you might as well just get Xanax XR, the extended release, because that's the only difference between Klonopin. Klonopin is twelve hours of a of a high. Xanax is like eight seven hours depending on the dose. So, like, the only difference is literally that, like, K-Pens, they, they're extended release. You automatically get a longer high. It's a longer-lasting high. Um, It's harder to get. And the upside, the like, literally, the only really plus is it tastes good, too. To, in my opinion, Klonopin tastes sweeter. Uh, Xanax just has that nasty-ass, like, chemical coke taste. You know, how, like, blow or, like, MDMA, they just, oh, my God, it tastes like fucking bleach, dude. But, like, Xanax, it, it tastes like bleach, like, dish soap. I don't know. It's 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 weird. But, but K-Pens, it just tastes like sugar. It's like this, like, sweet chemical sugar taste. It's at least, in my opinion, um, I, like, I, as always, stay safe with abusing chemicals. Um, always know what you're getting. Um, K pens, like I mentioned, it's no different than a Zan. It, it really is no different. A longer high, it tastes sweeter. Um, I've done a, I've not done much K pens. I've only really had a batch, like like thirty in a blister. I've I've only really sold them. I've never really popped them. I've done a couple times. I've I've had my fair share of mixing K-Pens with like Alprazolam. I've done like two milligrams of that, two milligrams of K-Pens, two milligrams of K-Pens, four milligrams by themselves. I've done it with like Tamazepam. I've done it with fucking Perks. Something you never want to do, okay? Um, That's really all I really have to say. K-Pens, I don't really want to do a, a whole ass video on it because it's literally a benzo. It doesn't do no different than Xanax. The only benzo that really does anything different is Tamazepam, in my opinion. But, hey, um, that's just all for today's video. Stay safe. If you get some K-Pens, use them properly. If you've gotten them prescribed, don't abuse drugs. If you do, fucking be safe, boys. As always, stay safe. As always, peace out. I love every single one of y'all. Thank y'all for 250 subs. Um, 
I'm going to be uploading a lot of videos more consistently. I'll see you guys in the next video. As always, peace out, y'all. Stay safe.